So now we will see how you can access SharePoint. Like mm -hmm. other applications, again, you need to log in in Microsoft365.com using your Microsoft account. And there you will click on SharePoint and it will take you on SharePoint homepage. From there, you can see all the websites, whatever you created for your company will be listed there. So again, we uh, you can also create website from here, but we have setting only admin can create website and that's why you can't create web you can't create website from here. So if you have that setting on in your organization, you can create website from here. So if you want to create a website, you will go here, click on admin and it will take you on admin page and there you can see we have so all click on so all and there you can see sharepoint and it will take you on sharepoint admin portal there you need to select active sites and from there you can create a new website so we are going to create a new website so once you will click on this it will ask you do you want to create a team site or communication site team site it will create a user group for that so if you are going to manage like uh, like communication in teams and other stuff as well you should select team site so i'm going to select a team site and i will give name demo team site you can give your uh, your company name demo stw intra intranet and here you can give owner so i am going to give name my name here english next and add member so i'm not going to add any member don't add any member ran uh, randomly what we will do is we will create groups and then we will allow this allow based on their group so just finish and you can see this in this list you can see that website and that was demo so it should be here somewhere uh, yeah this is the site so now you can click on this site here you can see the general information related to the website like basic info the name description and site name again description and also email address for this website website url is this hub site no other info and template team site so if you want to access this website you will click here either you can go you can go here and refresh you will have that website somewhere here so let me find demo it's not here so it might can take little bit time but let me access from here so this is the website so you can see by default uh, this is what we have as a website and here we have apply a, a site template invite team member upload files post news add a real time chat change look this is what we can do next but we are not going to do anything from this list so this is the website in next section we'll see how we will add other apps and stuff in this sharepoint site